All right, guys, welcome to a brand new video. And yet again, we are talking about the next update of Xiaomi, Redmi, Poco, whatever you want to call it. We are talking about the eligibility list of MIA 13.5, which device will get it, which device will not get it. The same video will be available in Hindi on our Hindi channel, so do subscribe there as well. So before we get into the details, if you haven't already, please subscribe because it doesn't cost you anything and it really motivates us to make amazing content like this. And without further ado, hello awesome people, welcome to Phone Ops. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. Now, this information, of course, is courtesy of this website, Xiaomi UI. They do keep update, updating a lot of information regarding Xiaomi devices and MI UI. So as you can see, MI UI 13.5 is not going to be a huge update, but it is going to be an incremental update. This is more like a polishing version, similarly to what you had on MI UI 12.5, right? So I'm not sure this time if we're going to have an enhanced version or not, but that's a discussion for another day. Now, sad news for these first bunch of devices. We are talking about the Mi 9 series. That is Mi 9, Mi 9 SE, Mi 9 Lite, Mi 9 Pro, Mi 9T and 9T Pro, CC9, CC9. Yeah, those devices were not available globally. But the heartbreaking news is K20, K20 Pro and K20 Pro Premium. So they will not be getting MIE at 13.5. So that's some sad news. Also, the Redmi Note 8, 8T and 8 Pro, 9A, 980, 9i and 9C. Poco C3 and C31 will also be missing out on these particular updates. Now, it's really, really saddening to see so many capable devices not getting the MIA 13.5 update because especially, yeah, I mean, the K20 Pro is a very capable device. Anyways, let's, let's leave that aside. Now, we're going to talk about the interesting part. We're going to talk about the eligible devices for the MI, that is Xiaomi, Redmi and Poco. So as you can see, of course, the latest 12 series, the entire 12 lineup will first get it. Then we have the 11T and 11T Pro. We have the Mi 11 Lite series, Mi 11 LE that is not available in India. 11i, 11i Hypercharge, the Mi Note 10 Lite, Mi 10, Mi 10T Pro. All these devices will definitely get. Also the Xiaomi Pad 5, Pad 5 Pro and 5G. Now, talking about the Redmi devices, the Redmi Note 11 series, of course, is going to get it. The Note 10, 10 Pro series is going to get it. So that is a good news for Note 10 Pro users. Also, the Redmi Note 9 and the Note 9 Pro series are going to get it. The K50 series will not launch in India. Of course, our beloved Mi 11X. So yeah, two devices that we have so far are going to get MIA 13.5. Now, when we talk about the entry level devices, the Redmi 9 series, the Redmi 10 series and the Note 11 Pro series are also going to get it. Now, as far as Poco is concerned, the M2 series, M3, M4, X4 Pro, X3, X3 Pro is also going to get MIA 13.5 and F4, F3 GT and C40, C40 Plus. Now, C40 was recently unveiled, so of course, they should be giving MIA 13.5 to that. All in all, very, very sad news for the K20 series of devices because uh, especially the K20 Pro, very, very capable, 855 is still very powerful. Let me know in the comment section what do you think about Xiaomi's decision to not update a bunch of devices and about Poco devices not getting some updates. Until the next one, this is Kalash signing off at PhoneOps. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.